the cloud. Start sharing my screen. Mm. Hmm. Trying to share my screen. Doesn't work. Yeah. Okay. Wow. Technology doesn't want to work with me today. There we go. Okay. But we see your screen now. If you can just make it good. a little bit bigger. How about now? That's good for my old eyes. Okay. Good enough? All right. Okay. Hi, everybody. Thanks for joining the Jenkins Advocacy and Outreach SIG meeting. Today is Thursday, January 26th. My goodness, we're at the end of the month already. Um, we're going to go over action items. And on the agenda, I have just a quick reminder about our Jenkins newsletter because it is coming towards the end of the month. Um, and then a quick talk about CDF. Wanted to share with you our discussion with CDF that John Mark and I attended the, a meeting with them. Um, and then events, some cup, upcoming events are FOSDOM, SCALE, CDCon, DevOps World. And then um, last but not least, at the end of our uh, discussion here, we'll talk about GSOC and our planning for some upcoming deadlines. Anything else that we need to add? Okay. Okay, so um, action items of FOSDOM. Thank you, Jean-Marc, for um, receiving the stickers and the banner and the um, the postcard. So I think we're good to go in that space. Uh, the other parts of the our pieces of the, the the materials that's needed for our stand is still with Olivier, which uh, Damien will be picking up and taking to the stand. Did um, you check that with him? I have. Olivia has everything. And he said that he has talked to Damien and they will arrange to get that there. Um, but I'm still waiting for Damien to let me know about the um, the Jenkins and Friends dinner. So that's still TBD. Okay. Okay. Anything else that I'm missing here, Jean-Marc? Uh, no, just a little comment. The banner looks great. Okay. Even my dog liked it, so <laughs> you know, it, it, it looks great, nice model, and the uh, Jenkins is the way stickers, uh, they are going to be very expensive on the black market, because they're super, <laughs> so very good stickers. All right, well, let us know how it goes, and um, I'll, I'll be tweeting as well. So, you know, when you're there, send me pictures and then I'll, I'll send out tweets. So thank you, Bruno and Jean-Marc in advance for attending that conference on behalf of Jenkins. Um, okay, so agenda item, Jenkins newsletter, that is since we're at the end of the month, the, the routine is that we work towards updating our, our, our updates and um, providing our SIG updates for to be posted in the beginning of the following month. So that's approaching soon. So just a reminder for all SIG chairs to update their, um, their SIGs. Um, so CDF, Jean-Marc, Bruno, and I, we attended their outreach committee. And there was a lot of interest in um, GSOC and a lot of the, um, the projects under CDF appears to show um, their interest in wanting to participate in it. And throughout the discussion, it's, I think it's a little bit too late for them um, because lots of preparations has to be done far in advance to show Google that we were, were um, interested and that you know we've done our homework and due diligence. Um, so then Lori, the the outreach chair, said that how about you know Jean-Marc and I put something together to help other projects to um, be better prepared for, for next year and also to have more communications and help promote the program. 
And so um, we met with them earlier this week and uh, the plan is to come up with infographics. Um, so really, you know, pretty designs to show the process, the timelines for G preparing for GSOC and, um, and how we can help other projects, other members, other contributors um, who wants to apply for this project in the following year. So Jean Morgan, I will take a, a lead in driving this effort with CDF. Anything else to add, Jean-Marc? Uh, no. Lori looked very excited to get information about that. Yeah. Yeah, and I think our goal is we want to help other projects get accepted since that we've got our some good experiences. And then we also want to get some messaging across, um, you know, that perhaps corporations or enterprises should invest in 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 um, supporting such programs and contributors to work or their employees to work in the open source and pay for them, whether part time, you know, or full time. Um, so maybe oh, highlight Cloud Bees as a best practice, somebody to look, um, you know, to follow. Uh, let me see. So events. So we've got FOSDOM that's coming up around the corner. And I think we're pretty good to go there. I just need to send out some last communications and firm up some of the stuff that we've been working to put together. So um, still waiting for the friends and uh, Jenkins and friends dinner. Uh, I believe we have a date, but we do not have a location firmed up. So still waiting for Damien to give me that information. Scale is still happening. That's gonna be uh, beginning of March. So um, I haven't really planned anything on it. So but I do have my hotel booked. So, um, but it should be, um, you know, cookie cutter for us. Mark and I are planning to be there. And then CDCon, their um, early bird submission, CFP submission has closed. So earlier this week, we talked about selecting five out of the 46 submissions that they're going to post for the early bird sessions. So, so far, it's, I mean, the sessions are looking pretty good. It varies from CD to open source projects. Um, I haven't seen any AI topics, on, uh, but it's pretty much CD and open source projects that um, submissions that we received. Any questions there? Okay. So DevOps world, um, we still don't have a date and location uh, for this yet. They are expecting a smaller crowd this year. Um, the CFP that is still a work in progress, so that has not been posted yet. Oh, uh, Bruno. That's me surprise, sorry about that. <laughs> okay. I'm not, oh, okay. You want to talk about that one? I'm done with DevOps World. Cool. Uh, no, just two minutes about that. Got it all accepted. That's a local, by local, I mean in Europe, Belgium, to be precise. Uh, at Dev Day 2023 about Jenkins and mobile apps development. That's all. Great. When is that? End of March 24, I guess. Oh, okay. Cool. Thanks for sharing that. You're welcome. I'll try to be there in the crowd, do some cheerleading. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and maybe bring stickers since you got 4,000 of them. Oh, okay. <laughs> Good. Well, we'll see. I need to see the conditions to register. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, hey, Basil. Thanks for joining us. Oh, hi. Perfect hi. timing, by the way. So, um, I mean, I'm pretty much done with the items on the agenda, unless anybody has questions for me. Okay, so we'll go right into the GSOC discussion. Right, so, I'd, like, I'd like to introduce it, then we, we move yeah. on. Okay, if um, you don't mind. Yeah, perfectly fine. I, the only thing that I wanna talk about is the um, our application. application. John That's Mark? the first point on my agenda. Yeah. Okay. Sure. All right. 
Take it away, please. Well, uh, just put the, the agenda uh, back because I'm going to do a small summary. Yep. Uh, so we're going to have um, a discussion about the, the GSOC status and do a roundup of uh, where we are. Uh, it will be outside of this meeting uh, and uh, the results uh, will be published and it is more work um, meeting. Now, what we will discuss is first, uh, we need to review and approve uh, the org application. So this is the document that uh, Elisa uh, uh, just presented. Then we're going to uh, do a preliminary review of all the projects in um, or project ideas uh, that are currently on the list. Um, as normally we reference that in our application and see if we have something strong enough uh, for that. And we'll review project description, we'll review uh, mentor teams globally and per project. And we're also going to uh, discuss the next steps and what are the next milestone. So we're once the, and just a summary about that is that um, once the application is entered and it's brewing, uh, we are um, going to kick off uh, the um, students or mentee part kickoff start to have a weekly uh, office hour to help students to work on their uh, application, explain them the project, guide them, review. So this is an important uh, phase. We're going to discuss how we're going to organize all that. The end of that phase is uh, April, April 4th is where the, the deadline is. So summarize. So a summary, we're going to review the application. This one is due now beginning of February. Uh, do a preliminary review of projects mentor teams and get set and organized for the um, uh, preparation phase. Uh, so, the, so the student preparation phase. Are there questions about that introduction? Uh, if not, then we'll dig into and stop the recording. Sounds good, John Mark. Okay, so we can stop the recording. Let me... Stop the recording.